This is what you should and shouldn't be buying at the 2024 Maji Market. It's the second annual Maji Market and there's a ton of new stuff to buy. Seeds, recipes, dishes without recipes, fireworks, wallpapers, and of course, new decoration. But what should you buy with your hard-earned envelopes and how much is this going to cost? Well, I'm going to assume you want everything like I do. Let's start by looking at the different vendors. There are six in total. Five that accept the 2024 Maji Market Currency Lucky Envelopes and one that accepts gold coins. The envelope vendors are Chapa Chase Prizes, Zeki's Lucky Catch, Reth's Street Specialties, Maji Market Fireworks, and Delilah's Sweet Treats, with the gold coin vendor being the Chapa Hut. So what should you buy? All of it, you say? Well, before you go chucking envelopes all over the fairgrounds, let me tell you some things to avoid buying. At least at first. At the Chapa Hut, you can buy the makeshift Garden Chapa and the makeshift Chapa High Rug. The Garden Chapa can also be found in Waterlogged Chest and Zeki's Wondrous Machine, while the Rug can be earned by completing the quest Hunting 101 or purchased in the Underground. The Maji Plush sold here was available last year, but if you are unable to snag it then, you can now. You may already own these, but if you don't, you could save your coin for later in the year if you wanted. The Maji Market Fireworks stand sells a variety of boom sparkles, but the Waterfall Fireworks I'd stay away from, at least for now. Located at Zeki's booth is the prize wheel. When you spin the prize wheel, you have a chance to win the various colors of Waterfall Fireworks. So until you've spent all your prize wheel coins, I'd hold off. Also, the Dragon Firework can be earned through your stamp card. And finally, Reth's Street Specialties. Reth sells a, the different varieties of the Hot Pot, which can be earned regular and starred from stamp cards for this event. He also sells Wild Green Onions and Wild Ginger, which can be found in abundance in Kilima. Kilima? Eh. Another note, Reth sells soy sauce, which is the only place to get it right now. We believe it will be available at Zeki's store after the Maji Market closes up shop. But enough about the things we shouldn't buy. Let's talk about the stuff we can buy. The Chapa Chase Prizes booth has most of the decorations that are available during this year's Maji Market. They have six Chapa pillows. The brown costs 900 envelopes, but the other five are 1,000 each. There are three New Year lamp posts available. The New Year bench, banquet chair, and banquet table. The New Year decorative fruit, and the mini Maji plush. Moving on to Zeki's Lucky Catch, there are five Kayakis available for purchase. However, my friends and I have not been able to get a Gold Star one at this time, which means they won't be placeable. If this is a bug and gets fixed, I'll update the pinned comment on this video. And if I happen to get one, I will update the pinned comment on this video. Zeki does sell one decoration, the Maji Market Basket, as well as six new wallpapers for 2,000 envelopes each. Back to Reth, he's got three dishes at his booth, which all have a chance to be gold starred. I had to buy seven lumpia, six noodle rolls, and five bonchung before getting the starred versions. The best thing on Reth's menu are the recipes though, which most require either soy sauce or one of the new crops. There are nine in total, the last of which is tied for the most expensive item at the market at 8,000 lucky envelopes. Most of the inventory at the fireworks stand is the waterfall and dragon fireworks that I suggested you avoid, but 
there is another. The floating lantern firework can be snagged for 125 envelopes, as well as two decorations, the Maji Market Lantern and the Maji Market Tall Lantern for 1100 and 1800 respectively. One of the most important booths at the market this year is Delilah's Sweet Treats. She has one decoration, the Maji Market Fruit Post for 4,000 envelopes, but the important items she sells are the seeds for the new crops, Napa Cabbage and Bok Choy Seeds. These sell for 15 each, but if you're patient and you want to save your envelopes, you only have to buy one each. Plant and harvest them and throw them all in the cedar. Rinse and repeat, and you've got more seeds. She also sells six dishes of various prices, which, just like Reth's dishes, have a chance to be starred. I had to buy one eight treasure rice, one Nan Goa, 12 sesame balls, two almond cookies, four Hopia, and eight Pepsi. That's all the Lucky Envelope vendors, and a quick tip, the best way to earn Lucky Envelopes is to play the Hot Pot minigame, which I may make a video on later, I don't know. But there is one more vendor at the market this year. Going full circle, we're back at the Chapa Hut, the gold coin vendor. The hut has the Chapa Mug, Garden Chapa, Chapa Hide Rug, the No Hunt sign, and the Maji Plush, regular size. If you were to purchase all of these items, it'll cost you 66,160 gold coins. But after all your cake parties, you probably walked in with twice that. The real question is, how many lucky envelopes are you going to have to earn at the mini games this year? Well, the math is a little rough on this if you're trying for Gold Star on Reth and Delilah's dishes and you don't know how many fireworks you will win from the prize pool. But if you were to buy one of each item from the Maji Market this year, you would need to earn a total of. Pause for dramatic effect. 82,155 lucky envelopes. That sounds like a big number, because it is. But I have all the faith in you. This is completely doable in the time frame that we have. This event is going to run until the end of February. That's all the information I have on the 2024 Maji Market vendors. I'll be streaming Paleo over on my Twitch channel for the duration of this event, but if you want a Paleo professional, go check out Quincy Sky over on Twitch as well. She is one of my best friends and does paleo content throughout the year. Both links will be down in the description. Good luck with the star dishes, prize wheel coins, and I will see you at the hot pot tables. Thank you so much for watching. Take it easy.